Hey YouTube, happy Friday. This is Sandy here and I'm here today to talk about my favorites, my current favorites. Um, so let's jump right in. The first favorite that I have this month is my smart case for my Apple phone, my iPhone. So what this does is it snaps onto your phone and it's got the the charger built into this so you basically get twice the amount of charge that you would normally get um, when you plug your phone in in the evening it charges up both the charger and your phone and so when you start to use it it runs down the charger on your case first and your phone is still at a hundred percent so long story short you can go, I can go all day without having to recharge my phone and I stream almost constantly. I'm on my phone a lot because I don't have a home phone so I really use it a lot. So that is my favorite. I got it from the Apple Store. It is $99. I've had it now for, I don't know, maybe a month or so and I am loving it. I really like the idea of not having to worry about my battery running down when I'm streaming. The other thing that I would like to share is uh, actual beauty item and this is a charcoal mask. Uh, this is by New Age Beauty. I got this from Marshalls and it was $4.99. I've had this for um, several months now. It's a pretty nice, nice size container but it is actually charcoal like a mud mask almost is what it looks like but this stuff is so good I use it once a week I leave it on for like 10 minutes and when you rinse it off it comes off your skin is just so smooth and if you have any um, blackheads or anything like that it dries it up with the uh, that charcoal activated charcoal that's in it so uh, this is from New Age Beauty and it is a wash off mask and you can pick it up at Marshalls. Um, you know Marshalls is one of those stores that you go in there and they may have something that you never see it again. They just have just oddball stuff but if I ever see that again I will definitely pick that up again. It's really good. Um, the next item that I wanted to share is also not a new item but it's one that I still really love and this is in the um, blueberry line blueberry I'm sorry curls line for hair products natural hair products this is the blueberry bliss the twist and shout cream I use this when I do my twist outs and I really like it and I've actually used a lot of this I think I've mentioned before I am a product junkie I try all types of products if they don't work I end up just with you know just using something once or twice and then never using it again but this stuff here I will definitely finish this off and be repurchasing it and you can get it at Target and when I bought it it was on sale which is what made me try it but I will definitely go back again and I want to say this might be like $10.99 I'm not really sure on the price I've had it for um, about maybe two months or so but that is a good good product the next item that I'm going to share are some sunglasses that I got now I've mentioned in a previous video that I recently lost my job um, and I found out several months ago that this was going to happen so one of the things that I started to do was to go to the doctor get all my medical appointments and everything out of the way well, in December of last year, I had just gotten new glasses, and um, I only need my glasses for reading. Um, there is a very, very slight prescription in them for, for distance, so this is like a, a bifocal, invisible bifocal, um, but I really don't need the distance. They just put a little something in just to give me some correction. So long story short, I don't drive in my glasses, but... Um, I got glasses in December so when I found out about my job in March I was like okay well I'm not gonna be able to you know have vision and coverage for a while or whatever so something told me to call them 
to see if I had any coverage, any benefit at all, even though I had just gotten it like three months prior. And they were like, yep, your benefit starts over in the calendar year. And I thought it was one year and one day. So because of that, um, I made an appointment to go get my glasses in after I confirmed everything because I, I didn't know that that was the case. So they were like, nope, you could have got glasses again January 1st. But anyway, so when I went in to get my glasses, they examined my eyes and everything. It had only been, you know, just a matter of months since I had gone before. And so my prescription didn't change at all. And they were like, you can get some more reading glasses um, if you want, or you can get some sunglasses. And I'm like, well, I don't know if that would really be worth it because, like I said, I don't wear my glasses all the time. I just use them for reading. So she says, well, do you ever like take your phone and you're out maybe outside in the walk, on a walk at a park or something and you look down on your phone and you need to be able to see? And I said, yeah, actually that happens quite a bit. And she was like, well, why don't you consider the sunglasses? And then you could wear them to drive or whatever and everything. So I thought about it and I said, why not? You know, and I had a very, very generous um benefit for frames my lenses are covered completely with the tin and everything and then i got a pretty substantial benefit for the frame and i had flexible spending dollars that i needed to use up anyway so long story short i went in there and i picked these glasses which are ferragamo frames and i absolutely love these glasses and this was like the best investment ever i never would have thought that prescription glasses would have been beneficial for me but i love them and i find that i see so much better driving even with them so i mean they've got the uv uh protection and all of that and it's different somehow than the sunglasses that you just pick up at the store you know the the protection i just feel like it's just so much so much better there's like no glare whatsoever with these glass i look like um Ray Charles, but no, just kidding. But yeah, so I absolutely love these glasses. So this is um, one of my favorites for this month. Just putting them back in here. Now the next items that I have are all cleaning products. And I have just been cleaning a lot because I mentioned that I'm gonna be selling my house so just trying to get like deep cleaning done, like cleaning baseboards, cleaning walls, things like that, that I needed to um, get done just to make sure everything is spruced up. So one of the things that I thought I was going to have to do was get the house, get certain rooms painted or certain areas painted because there were some just scuffs on the wall or just things like that. But had a guy come over to give an estimate and he was like, all you need to do is get this Mr. Clean um, Magic Eraser and start wiping down, um, you know, these spots because it wasn't as bad as, as what I thought it was. So this is a favorite. This definitely worked wonders. And I've had these before and used them for just various things, cleaning out the tub or whatever, but really, really good for cleaning walls. And I never had even thought about that. So that's a favorite. Um, another favorite is Method Furniture Polish. This stuff smells so good. I just really love it. So I've been using this to clean furniture. I also have some uh, Watkins All Purpose Cleaner. And I'm really loving this stuff because it has like essential oils. I have Myers also. Um, but they they don't have that cleaning chemical type smell to them and they just leave your house so, so very fresh. So these are favorites. I've been using them a lot to clean um, areas to get my house ready to put it on the market. So those are great items. And the very last item is something that I was just introduced to last week. I went to visit uh, my cousin and she offered some of this um, Boom Chicka Pop sweet and salty kettle corn. And my initial response was no thanks because I don't like kettle corn. 
Um, but then I got hungry and I tried it and I really, really, really liked it. Um, and so I'm not even going to tell you how much of this stuff I have eaten in the last week since I found out about it. So Denise, if you're watching, thanks. <laughs> but this stuff is really, really good. And I also found that they have the light kettle corn too. Now this is 70 calories per cup, but they have the light kettle corn that's like 35 uh, calories per cup, which I will be getting that because that'll be a lot better uh, point wise for me. But this is really good to have as a little snack. And what I really like about it is it's not real, real sweet and it's got, um, you know, the sweet and salty contrast, which I guess all kettle corn is that way. But for whatever reason, I've never liked kettle corn. It's always been too sweet, but this is not. So I really like that. So those are my favorites for this month. I really didn't have a lot of things. I have um, not been doing shopping. <laughs> Uh, so most of these things are things that I've been using for a while, but really, really am enjoying them. So that is all I have to share today. I thank you so much for coming back and checking us out. We appreciate each and every one of you. Our channel is growing very slowly, but, but we appreciate it. And uh, we just ask that you subscribe, comment, and uh, share our videos so that we can uh, continue to grow and continue to come back and share with you. Thanks so much.